President Bola Tinubu has been urged to withdraw the ministerial post of Mrs. Hanatu Musawa as Minister of Art, Culture and Creative Economy. Civil Liberties Organization National Treasurer Comrade Halima Ibrahim, who made the call in Abuja, said Ms. Hanatu Musawa is currently a serving member of the NYC before her appointment as a minister by the present administration. She pointed out that NYSC has proven beyond all reasonable doubt that the certificate of Enugu State Pitamba paraded is not issued by them. The CLO is concerned and dismayed that some public office holders in the country who occupy offices of public trust are involved in forgery of public documents, including educational results and the NYSC discharge certificate. More worrisome is the fact that some of these individuals who are quite powerful, are challenging anyone, including the courts, who dare to question their nefarious actions. In some cases, as the CLO has discovered, these individuals end up being aided by some agents of other institutions of the state to undermine investigations in pending cases. Some of these cases are yet to be resolved, but remain quite troubling. In the last six months, the country has witnessed two festering cases which are yet to be resolved. One of the cases involved is the current governor of Enugu State, Mr. Peter Mba, and the other is serving minister of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Ms. Hanatu Musawa. Also speaking, President Civil Liberties Organization called on the Supreme Court, Comrade Igo Akeroka, to intervene justically on the side of the truth. He said the group is worried about the increasing urge of Nigerian politicians to forge certificates for official use. He said the group is focusing too much on the federal government, while the subnational has done a lot of damage to the unity of the country. Comrade Igo Akeroga. On this, we are not only, if you read that statement very well, we are worried about the increasing urge or the increasing penchant for Nigerian politicians to forge certificates. It's not about him per se. We have that of, we said in the last six months, that should be worrisome to anybody. If you went to the university and you, 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 you participated in NYC, why would you want to have a ruler, a governor, a president, who did not go through these processes and wants to spend your money? That's our concern as a society group. We are saying here that the matters before the court, you know, by the document that we have, they ask. CLO is not an organization that we go, we have asked both, both sides to state their cases to us. Peter Oba said, his representative said, documents to us. I also got in touch with, uh, with uh, the Labour Party, who also sent documents. On our own, we have gotten our lawyers to look at the documents. We, have, we are not passing any judgment, but on the face of those documents, and for NYC to write that they did not issue Mr. Peter Mba the NYC certificate, the CLO took a position to say that this is enough for us to address the press conference. 